Hello, welcome back to Tips and Time Savers. My name is Danny Rocks. Have you ever heard the expression trust but verify? It's a great phrase for guiding your approach to data that someone sends you. Trust, I would never open up a data file from someone unless I actually trusted the source. Verify, nevertheless, I trust the source but I verify the accuracy of the formulas and the structure of the spreadsheet before I would make a business decision based upon that data. I'll demonstrate how to do this using the go to special dialog box. Now let's take a look at this spreadsheet. This is typical of the thousands of spreadsheets that we see. And at first glance, everything appears to be just fine. How can we verify by using the edit go to special dialog box. Let's move this out of the way and in this case I'm going to verify by looking for all of the cells that contain formulas. Click OK and all of the cells that contain a formula are highlighted. So here it makes it very easy for us to spot that someone actually hard-coded in a value which looked reasonable but we couldn't spot it so easily without using our edit go to special and choosing formulas. Sometimes it's easier to do edit go to special and notice with the go to the keyboard shortcut is control G and in our special this time instead of choosing the formulas let's choose constant values click OK and once again this cell right here should contain a formula but it contains a constant it stood right out so let's correct that by copying the cell that has the formula and move it over okay let's take a look at some other possibilities in our edit go to special dialog box let's bring it up again let's use the keyboard shortcut control G Remember to look for special. Let's move this dialog box out a little bit. And within formulas, notice that if we want to narrow down our search, for example, if I'm interested in verifying my text formulas, I uncheck or unselect, deselect the other possibilities, and I only want to look for text formulas. So there you go. It makes it very easy to spot that in this cell someone is hard coded in a value rather than inputting the formula. So once again we'll make that change. Let's take a look at some of the others. Another keyboard shortcut for bringing up the dialog box if you don't like control G the F5 key is the go-to shortcut. The dialog box special and in this case let's look for formulas and this time let's look within logicals. So we'll deselect all of the other possibilities, zero in on logical formulas once again. Hard code it rather than a formula. And the same thing for numeric values. Now coming back to our main spreadsheet, sometimes, and let me just hard code a value in here, sometimes people prefer another technique which is the control tilde shortcut and with the control tilde visually now we see all of the cells that contain the formulas and the actual formula so it's very easy to spot a cell that should have contained a formula and not be hard coded so there you go you've learned some techniques to trust but verify your spreadsheet data we'll see you in the next tips and time savers